If you've ridden the Brown Line recently, chances are you've seen this mural covering two buildings in Lakeview. But over the past few days, chances are you've noticed it's gone and it's been painted over. CBS 2's Jeremy Ross is in the South Loop with more on why. Jeremy. Well, good evening, Rob. Good evening, Erica. The mural right behind me stretches two stories tall. The artist responsible for it is well known for the character, the bear chap. That's the yellow character that you see repeated there. The artist's other mural that vanished took up to a month to complete. It was on display for only a matter of days. At Lakeview's Polina L stop, you'll see plenty of traffic and art coming and going, but it's what you can no longer see near the Brown Line platform. Definitely, it's a shame. Not thrilled, <laughs> not thrilled. Shocking to some. Wow. Disturbing to others. Beautiful art too, like it had clearly taken a long time. This mural by artist J.C. Rivera was finished August 18th, his signature bear champ character wrapping around the sides of two buildings, but according to the Lakeview Chamber of Commerce, five days later they learned it was painted over. City says someone saw graffiti rather than Rivera's graffiti inspired murals like this one and reported it. So obviously not a work of graffiti. It was so clearly a very intentional piece of city art. It's sad. <laughs> Chicago Streets and Sanitation said they mistakenly covered over Rivera's work. According to chamber documentation, they've earmarked about $60,000 for seven murals over the course of the year. A portion of that paid for the now absent artwork. The money supplied by neighborhood property tax dollars. That's a lot of money. It's disappointing. The cost of the city removing the artwork is unknown. A little bit of waste of cash, yeah. But it all adds up to a tapestry of taxpayer waste. I wish they would uh, respond to rat complaints as quickly as they responded to cover up this graffiti. That would be a beautiful thing. In a statement, Streets and Sanitation tells us that they are working with the aldermen to address the matter. The chamber also echoing those thoughts. All parties hoping for a resolution as for when that'll happen or the associated cost. That is anyone's guess. Live in Old Town, Jeremy Ross, CBS2 News. Robin Erica. Okay, Jeremy, thanks.